Hi, welcome to another JFDI. Your project needs a code name. You didn't know that. It needs a code name because that is going to give you some extra little bit of inspiration that you might find useful halfway through. Oyster silver cockroach. It's going to help you connect various different imagery in your mind. Having that is something that might tie things together. And if you don't have it, you're going to end up with a file that's just called story 05 or techno track number seven version 01. Not going to help you. It also makes your projects more memorable when you're looking back through archives of things that are perhaps unfinished, things that you didn't uh, complete and you want to go back to. Foxglove ptarmigan pheasant. There are loads of random code name generators online. Uh, so just pick a couple, try them out. You can often change parameters and, and they'll come up with things like uh, a color, uh, a type of bird or a city name or something like that. Shrimp maroon boa. So you can get, you can get like millions of combinations of randomized code names. Begonia duck buzzard. Um, give it a try, see what you come up with. It, it might give you that, that little bit of uh, spark of inspiration when you're uh, working on the beginnings of a new project. Wisteria Tales, Chapter 1 The house burns, its firelight reflected in the hoofprints that surround your father's body. He had done everything he could to stop them from taking Ryland away, while you, meanwhile, hid in the goat pen, clutching your fingers over your mouth and holding back screams as the red-armored captain ran her spear through father's belly and into the mud. This project is pulled together by three chaps over in the US. I've no idea how to explain it. If you go to wisteria.ai, you'll find uh, the latest episode of a story that's being written. There's lots of different work streams to it. There's a live action and animation uh, feature that's being pulled together. And there are some podcasts which are like meta commentaries of the story that's going on within the story. That's I'm going to be away for the next two weeks, so I'm not going to be able to upload any more videos, but uh, I really hope you get a chance to check out the techno set that I released on Wednesday last week, if you haven't listened to that already. I'm thinking I might like to pull together some of my sketch work and photography and combine that somehow with maybe some storytelling to go alongside the music, and maybe develop some little bits of storyline to go along with each track. For example, there was a track that I did called Undertow, which had like some um, sea and, and waves crashing uh, as the artwork that kind of fed in with the sounds that I selected. So there's some potential there maybe to tie a few of the different uh, tracks together with a story thread. So I might go back and edit the descriptions of the, the tunes uh, and, and try and create maybe an episodic little story. If you've got any ideas, then uh, please leave them in the comments. I'll put my Instagram link below uh, because I'm going to start using that a bit more. Thanks very much again for tuning in and I'll see you after my little break. Take care. Cheers. Thank you.